invite the children to join me for a time with children. Come on down, kids. Little children, come on to me. Little children, come on to me. You are, you are made, made in God's, God's image, image so perfectly. Little children, come on to me. Good morning, girls and boys. It is so good to be together this morning with you. Thanks for tuning in. So this is the Easter season, as you know. So we've been singing hallelujahs, right? And we've been saying Christ is risen. Christ is risen from the dead. And that is the Easter story, but sometimes it's hard to understand for people of all ages, not just kids, but adults too, that Jesus went into a tomb and then he came out, rose from the dead. So what does that mean? So I thought, I'm going to tell you the story in a different way today. So you probably know what a caterpillar looks like, right? And a chrysalis or a cocoon. And that's what happens. Another way of telling the Easter story is that the caterpillar wraps itself up and becomes a cocoon or a chrysalis. And then out of that comes a beautiful butterfly. And so the butterfly is actually a sign. It's a picture of hope and new life for us. And so butterflies are so beautiful, aren't they? And we're starting to see them now. The spring is coming. And so as I was thinking about right now, we're kind of um, trapped in our homes. It feels a little bit like a cocoon, huh? We're close with uh, our family, but we can't really get out and be with anybody else. And so I was thinking, we need some butterflies. We need some reminders that um, new life is coming and that someday we'll be able to get out of our cocoons, right? So I posted a picture of a butterfly on the website, and I invite you to print it and color it like I did. And this is what I want you to do this week, girls and boys. If you can color your butterfly and hang it in one of your windows in your house, maybe facing the street so that when people walk by, they can see your butterfly and it can make them smile and help them have a sense of, of hope and happiness that there is new life coming and that it will remind them that Jesus is risen and the butterflies will fly again and uh, life will be good. So friends, if you want to print out your butterfly, color it and put it in your window, uh, that would be awesome. Thank you so much for spreading this joy. So now let us pray together. Hands up high, clap them together, bring them down over your eyes, close your eyes, open your mouths, and repeat after me. Dear God, Dear God thank, you thank you for butterflies, for butterflies and, for Jesus, and for Jesus, who promises us, who promises us new, life. new life. Amen. Amen. Thank you, boys and girls.